Hi, my beautiful Capricorn. Welcome to my channel. My name is Natasha, goddess of life, 1111. If you are new to my channel, welcome. If you are returning subscribers, welcome back. This reading is for my lovely, beautiful Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Thank you, God. Thank you, Universe, Universal Energy, my sister, my spirit, God, the pure white light, I can do my call, I send it, Masters. Please give my lovely, lovely, beautiful Capricorn a clear, precise, honest message. This is a general love reading. It won't resonate with everyone. If this reading is not resonate with you, please check out your other birth chart placement for more clarity. Take what resonates and leave the rest. Thank you so much to all my copies that have been supporting my channel. I'm grateful and thankful. Thank you for all you guys' donation. Also join Patreon. And we are in Mercury Retrograde, so I am unavailable for personal reading. But as you guys know, Mar this Mercury retrograde is no nothing to play with because we have a, um, I think an eclipse coming. Also Mercury retrograde. Plus we are in Gemini season. Yes, so you know, be mindful of how we communicate. Be mindful of who's coming toward you. You know what I'm saying? There's a lot of miscommunication and it's gonna be tough. So stay tuned, guys. Stay tuned. So you have sacral chakra here. And for uh, the heart chakra, okay? And here you are, Capricorn. So you're coming in the readings. You are coming in, in the readings. So I like it. So it's just like there is someone that you have a lot of, um, you are very passionate about. Someone in here you are very attracted to. I feel like, you know, you are really worried about, you know, <laughs> you are really about, you are afraid of, this person might be breaking your heart. But I feel like you guys is fine. I feel like someone, some type of timid um, energy here. Like, you know, you're very attracted to someone. Every time you think of this person, your heart beat, uh, you know, faster and faster and faster. Or someone you're dealing with, but I, that's the energy I'm getting. you very sweet energy with the heart chakra but so you know if you feel that way you might need to heal your heart chakra a little bit but i feel like you have a lot of passion with someone you might actually secretly you might actually even in love with someone here with the heart chakra and sickle chakra because you feel like this person is creative they are very passionate and is that's your energy show me the person um That thinking of Capricorn spirit. Show me the person Capricorn was thinking of or that thinking of Capricorn. Okay, thank you. So it could be a fire sign. We have solar plexus chakra, which is a three, which is beautiful. This is someone that, you know, balanced spiritually. The Trinity here. <laughs> okay. And this person could be a, some type of speaker. Yeah. Could be a Libra, but I feel like this is someone that's come and told you to give you some type of justice. You know, whether you know this person or not, you know, this will balance. This is about compromise, balance. So whomever this person here, they are very balanced. So they're bringing you some type of justice. So if you have been broken hearted in the past due to some type of relationship, this person is coming to give you some type of justice. That does not mean they've been with you. This is Libra energy, which is that this is good karma. So someone in here is, you know, this is some type of karma they have to repay. So it's good karma, not bad karma. Give me two cards for Capricorn Spirit. Oh, well, excuse me, Capi. you manifesting this person. Like I said, it could be a Libra or that's just your justice. They're coming to bring you justice, giving and receiving. Yes, indeed, because you are manifesting this person. Mm, seven of, wow, okay. Seven of one is at the bottom. This person could be a little bit of guard, a little bit guarded with, you know, defensive, guarded, very protective of the energy. That's what I'm feeling here. Someone in here could be, have to defend themselves with it, take the lead and stuff. This person will make the change. This person will take, you know, the leads. You know, this is someone that, like I said, someone that very creative. They have a lot of, you know, very creative, a lot of creativity going on. 
and they have the mildest thoughts so they will take action when it's come to you even if this person is guarded they will take action because this person might be de dealing with a lot they might be defending themselves against a lot of people that's what i'm feeling here someone is standing their ground here yeah look at that seven of you know seven of swords also here I have two cards, please, for Capricorn Spirit. Thank you. Pay attention to the red flags. The sign I caution you. This could be the one. You manifest this person, but I felt like when it's come to giving and receiving, um, you know, because this is like you probably already in a situation that is giving and receiving, or you could be you know, in a situation where there is that much giving in whatever situation you are currently in. That's what I'm feeling you because this is your energy, right? Giving and receiving here. So if you're not going to give to a uh, in receiving in this situation, they will be telling this person to pay attention to the red flag. Two cards list for the person Capricorn is dealing with. Wow, reconciliations and chemistry. Someone felt like that would be justice to come and told you. But there's some type of reconciliation because you guys known each other before. There's, you know, you guys have a lot of chemistry together. You know, this is, I feel like this is someone from your past. So there's some type of reconciliation, playfulness and stay optimistic. But what I'm feeling here, Capricorn, Pay attention to the red flag, the sign are cautioning you. So either you or this person, someone wasn't giving much into this relationship. Or someone isn't currently giving to someone else. Three cards for Capricorn. Yeah, the tower. If you are in a relationship, there's giving and receiving. You're getting a tower moment. I'm sorry to say that. Yeah, eight of pentacles. So... If whatever this relationship, whether it's a financial situation you guys are in, is coming, there's a tower. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Can't make this up. Can't make this up. Capricorn, whatever the relationship you are currently in, if it hasn't happened, it's about to happen. We have the tower, eight of materials, and the death card. There's a marriage, some type of stability, collaboration. There's a thing. There's a relationship that's coming to an end here that's what i'm saying so when they say pay attention to the red flag um don't feel like they're talking about this person i feel like they're talking about someone else because in order for you to have a reconciliation with this person over there that's bringing you justice you have to end a relationship here in order for that to happen three cards for the person that's coming towards um okay i didn't have to say nothing see the lovers nine of swords yeah, there's some, you know, like I said, there's some type of communi online communication and three of cups. Yeah, if you want to have that celebration, you want to have that reunion with someone here, because I feel like, you know, there could be, this person could be a Gemini, because we have the Knight of Swords and the Lovers. So this is someone that you felt like there's a lot of, you know, you know, you have to climb a you know mountain and stuff like that, but things will change. You know, things will change for the better when you finish climbing this mountain. When you you know, that's what they say. You know, you have a choice you to make, but you know, I'm I'm looking at this little hill. This could be you know, you don't have to do this if you don't want to, but I feel like this is good. It will teach you. You know, yes, thing is hard because those are spiritual connection. There's no spiritual connection that easy. But I feel like, you know, if you can, you know, get down of this mountain and stuff like that, you can, you know, you and this person could work. This relationship could work. Because you probably have to, you know, step onto a few toes or whatnot. You know what I'm saying? In order for you to have that. Or oh, this person might have to do that when it's come to you. But... I'm sorry to tell you, there's a relationship. Your current relationship is coming to an end. Yeah, Nine of Cups here with the Ace of Swords. There's some type of truth and the High of End. Yeah, beautiful. There's some type of truth that's coming, that's going to come towards you. You know what? This is crazy. 
because they can't just blow out and just fall on the floor and i'm sweet say look at them so yeah nine of swords page of materials page of materials and page of pentacles yeah you're gonna about to feel there's some truth you're gonna find out with yourself about someone you are dealing with that's gonna give you an aha moment and the truth is gonna set you free truth about the commitment here someone could be just in a commitment with you they just you know just for stability but the truth is going to come out and it's gonna give you it's gonna be you know some type of wish fulfillment for you once you hit that truth it's gonna bring you some type of wish fulfillment because you're gonna be a bit shocked but you know for some of you you could be dealing with someone that have other options and the truth is gonna like this person is entertaining other people or this is you clarify the death card please for my lovely lovely so we have a you have fire here scorpio scorpio energy here and we have a lot of gemini a lot of scorpio virgo we have virgo scorpio taurus capricorn and a lot of gemini and libra may i please um clarify the death card <laughs> nine of wands Yeah, I feel like someone is in the wounded warrior energy right now. The hangman, yeah. Very protective, very guarded. You know, this is like, okay, someone in here is so protected. They're like, okay, I'm just going to continue. Protected what belongs to me. Someone in here is just very, very extremely patient. That's what I'm being to find some type of enlightenment and some type of clarity. Clarify the hangman. Pisces energy. Yeah, someone is giving to someone is is uh, juggling because this flow on top of the eight of materials so like i say you guys could be working with you know a few people that you're juggling in here that's what i'm feeling here with the two of pentacles sideways clarify the eight of materials for capricorn two of wands someone is making a decision with the two of wands here wow look at that Five of Pentacles, like I said, someone is making a decision and see the end here to end the situation that has a third party. I'm telling you, see, the Justice, Libra, and Three of Cups. There's going to be some type of reunion. It could be with the Libra again, because we have, you know, we have the Justice here. We have Justice here. So we have a Libra, very prominent here. So you guys could be dealing with a Libra. But you all know that this is about to come to an end. With the eight of it with the eight of pentacles, the five of pentacles, this is the ending it to some type of lack. And you will be able to reunite with, with the Libra here. Could be a Libra or could be, you know, anyone that's that stopped try to bring you some type of justice but something has to end here with the five of pentacles there's a relationship that end with the death card there's a relationship with the tower clarify the tower to your pentacles yeah a partnership we're working together a collaboration you know that's what i'm feeling here with the two of pentacles because in the two of pentacles it's only a single person working there's yeah yeah, because the situation become a burden with this ten of wands. Yeah, it's coming to an end. Regret with more sadness. Clever the five of cups, please. Yeah, some of somebody here is have they having a lot of regret, a lot of remorse. Night of you know, night of wise. This is someone that take action here. Yeah, page of cups and communicate a situation. Someone make a decision to communicate, take action, communicate, and it's bringing a whole, it's bringing some type of collaboration. Uh, it's going to end it in some type of co collaboration, but it's justice. It's supposed to happen. This is good karma. Because I feel like there's someone in here that call, whatever this group, whatever this situation, someone in here call it out. It's almost like someone is being exposed 
to a situation here they call it out and you know justice you know with this knight of wands page of cups this is a communication a message the wall the chariot king of pentacles and the knight of swords yeah something is coming to an end a cycle coming to an end with group and things like that because it's become very known or a lot of people knows about it clarify the two of pentacles for capricorn temperance see i like the two of pentacles it's balance temp the temperance is bringing balance into your life Balling, you know, bringing back once this end, whatever this you ended this work project with, you know, these people, you're gonna have you see, Queen of Pentacles, Queen of Swords, Ace of Pentacles, Three of Swords. Look at this, Ace of Pentacles, Three of Swords. This, like I said, something is going to bring balance and bring healings into the situation. You could be dealing with the you know the queen of swords libra here you could be a partner with libra but something is you know there's something is coming to an end here and it could be also be some type of same sex same sex relationship clarify the lovers king of cups no it we have the king of cups we have the queen of swords queen of pentacles because someone chose to work you know, standing their ground, standing their power, the lover is here, could be, you know, there's a king of cups also involved, yeah. Someone in here chose to be very cold, not very cold, but someone in here tend to be um, very um, analytical. They're using their, you know, very logic instead of, you know, someone in here standing their ground, no matter what, queen of swords, clever the queen of swords. Yeah, the chariot. The chariot. Yeah, look at that. There could be some projection here. Let's see. Clever the chariot. This is moving forward. Yeah, wow. Look at that. The emperor. Yeah, someone in here chose to stand their ground, be logical, and also, you know, be a little bit ruthless here. I feel like the chariot is, a, you know, to have that confidence in order for her to have that control, to have that confidence with the chariot and the emperor. This is someone that has a lot of self-control, a lot of self-determination to achieve what they want to stand in the ground, standing in the power, not letting some, not letting people treat them any kind of way. That's what I'm feeling here. And because of that, because of the structures and the self-control, because I feel like someone in here calls someone out here. Clever the Knight of Swords. Yeah, the Empress. Libra energy. Mm, mm, mm. Yeah, someone calling uh, justice on a situation. Clever the Empress in the reverse. Seven of Wands. Yeah, someone that had to defend themselves here the wheel of fortune good karma someone whomever this person is you guys are dealing with so what i'm i see the queen of swords chariot the emperor someone he had to defend it themselves and they got the permission of the universe to do so with the wheel of fortune or pride clever the three of cups two of pentacles someone is juggling two people Clarify two of pentacles, king of swords, air sign. Clarify the king of swords. Ooh, ooh. Why are you in the reverse, Cappy? What happened? Mm -mm. Why is Capricorn is in the reverse? It's not you, Capricorn. This is the king. This this is someone that's in that energy. Whoever this king of swords here, they could be the same. I feel like someone in here is really pissed off and they are in a reverse let me see clever they um clarify the devil in a reverse why is the devil in a reverse spirit <laughs> somebody is watching 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 why let me see. Clarify the page of swords. 
seems like I will have to do bonus sweeting for all this sign tomorrow. Page of Swords, Seven of Pentacles. Someone here black, so they don't know anything else to do but watching another person because they feel black. What is it Capricorn need to know, Spirit? What is it Capricorn need to know? Okay. Mm -hmm. Nine of Pentacles. Yep. Yep. Ten of Swords. Yeah, something is ended here. Ten of Swords, Ten of Pentacles, the Unknown, the Nine of Cups, and Three of Wands. Yeah, someone is going to move forward um, confidently, victoriously with the Chariot here. Whatever everyone was expecting. It's a boom, bala boom, and a big N-O per the universe. I feel like you're very attracted to this person, Copy. So what happened? You wanted some justice. Yeah, listen deeply. You know, your ancestors, your spirit guide tried to heal you. Yeah, and they're asking someone here to have compassion. What is you to have compassion for someone or someone have compassion for you? I feel like more I'm hearing forgiveness because yeah, learning experience. So there was a lesson for you guys because whatever this relationship is, holy love and trust the universe. This is supposed to be a spiritual connection, <clears throat> holy connection you have with someone here. But I felt like people get out of hand because they want to have their cakes and eat it too. And whether it's you or the person you are dealing with. So the universe is asking someone here to have compassion. Because I feel like, you know, there's some type of healing. Someone ancestors and spirit guides try to help them heal. Like I got your back. Because I feel like some type of sadness with these two cards. Because I feel like either you didn't learn a lesson or the person you are dealing with did not learn a lesson that's what i'm feeling here and it's kind of sad because i feel like someone in here they got some type of good karma because they have to continuously defending themselves online against a lot of people whomever this person you are dealing with is just a constant battle of they have to constantly constantly like defending themselves Mm. All right, copy. That's all I have for you guys. Don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and comment. Bye, Capricorn.